everyone, it's Jessica from The Art of Education, and this is Paint Dispensing for Dummies. There are lots of different ways to dispense paint and hold paint in your art room, and I want to share with you the wide spectrum of ways that you can easily dispense your paint. The first are some store purchased type of um, receptacles. Just a little plastic cup like this works great. You have to wash them out, but um, they're durable, they'll last a long time, and students can do mixing in them. I also like to use these mixing trays when we do color wheels so students can make their yellow, their green, their yellow green, their blue green, all in the same um, compartment. So I use these quite a bit actually. Um, these little muffin cups, or you could use muffin liners, are really nice because you can reuse them a few times, but they're still disposable and you can throw them away, which um, for some of us washing at the sink can be pretty taxing when you have 700 students painting. The solo, little solo cups with the lids are really handy, especially when you want to save paint, as you know, from one class to another. And you can even Sharpie on the front who's, what students it is, what color it is, and um, really save your paint that way because you're not wasting it. Some homemade ideas for dispensing your paint um, are some things you could just buy at the store, things that are really inexpensive, like paper plates. I actually chopped these in half. You can see they've been used and reused. And the student said, why are you chopping them in half, Mrs. Bosley? And I said, well, I used to have one paint receptacle and now I have two. And they're like, oh, so it's a way to kind of save. Plus, I let it dry and then use it the next day with the next third grade group that's also painting with blue. And by the end of the week, they're pretty trash, but I at least feel good that I've used them all week. Um, one of my favorite ways to use paint, especially if we're doing a lot of painting and it's messy, is just using a magazine. You just dispense the paint, students use it, get it all messy, and then when you're done with it, I like to just fold it in half, so then you don't get paint all over, tear it off, and look, you have another clean surface to dispense your next paint. Fold it in half, tear it off, and in a big catalog, you can get a lot of paint dispensing for cheap, free, and students will love it, it's kind of fun. So those are some ways to dispense paint from the cheap to the expensive to the washable to the disposable. Enjoy paint dispensing for dummies.